My name is Ephemius Konstantinidis and I am assistant professor in digital marketing working for the BMS faculty in the University of Twente. One of my courses is called Advanced Topics in Digital Marketing. It's a master course and in this course the students have to do a different assignments. One of the assignments is to test and improve the usability of a website. A website of a theater, of a bookstore, of a supermarket. In this case, we have an assignment focused on a theater here in Enschede. The students use different techniques, for example, eye tracking, facial recognition, but also uh, traditional techniques like interviews, uh, focus groups, click-through analysis, or even uh, detecting emotions by using one of these devices. And by combining two or three of, of these techniques, they try to identify what can be improved in the website and offer to customers a better experience. This is a screenshot of the website of the theater. For example, on the left, you can see uh, the different points here where people are uh, looking individually. And on the right side, you can see the heat maps. If you add all the individual observations, you see, for example, that uh, some points are looked much better than others. Uh, the more dark the color, uh, the more people are looking to this point. Now, this is an example to identify, for example, if people are seeing what we want them to see or not, and how, many, how much time they have to spend in order to find out what they look for. And, of course, what kind of emotions they have. Are they getting irritated? Uh, are they okay with that? Are they happy? And uh, this is one example of how we use uh, eye tracking in order to do this kind of work. The BMS lab has been always very helpful in uh, many ways. First of all, uh, training the students because you need some training in order to be able to use the equipment. And sometimes uh, you need to help uh, students during the experiments because of different problems. So in all these cases, the BMS lab has been very helpful and has been uh, a big contributor in the success of this project.